Would you look at the time? It's time for another video. Good day to you, fellow adventurers throughout time and space. It is I, the Cowardly Time Lord. Welcome you back to Let's Play Breath of Fire 1, Part 38. Anyways, it's time we rescued poor Nina from her amnesia. Also, I would go climb talk. It's, you know, I think I will do that in this episode. But I'll do it off screen. Oh, also, you need to buy... Apparently, it's a good idea to buy the, the a thing here that I don't have the character for. I mean, I mean, I thought it's actually kind of obvious when I really think about it. You should buy the thing for Nina. At least I think so. Let's see what the little... So... I what the Lord of Vapor does, but apparently it's something you want. Anyways, um... So we must see the doctor. I believe this is the doctor's house. No, this is not the doctor's house. Doctor! Doctor! Oh, also, this might be my last video for a while. As... I will be going away over Christmas break to several places. I believe this is the doctor's house. So do you need to consult a doctor? That doctor is famous. Now, E requires very specific items. Which I can tell you right now, I do not have all of them. One of them you can't get until after you talk to him anyway, so. Amnesia, that's easy. The tonic has always been effective. The tonic contains pufferfish, root, sea nut, and white antler. Coconut. Poison fish, root, okay. It's poison fish, root, coconut, and white antler. I do not have coconut. I do not have poison fish. I have white antler and root. It would be easy to make if I had the ingredients. So. You notice how there's a guy there now? Yeah, he is important for the poison fish. Search here. Search here and enter, friend. I don't know. Bye-bye, guy. You take pass! I'm going to replace the root in my inventory. Okay, I'll meet you at the top of talk. Also, if you don't know why I'm going back to talk, it's because, well, I have to go over here anyways. And also, the item at the top of talk is not important, but it's interesting. Anyways, want to see what I climbed up talk to get this time? The Mist Sword! It's useless. It, it can only be equipped by Ryu, and it's useless. Anyways, let's exit... And go back to Tunlin real quick. Whoop to Tunlin. Eventually we have to warp back here, but there's something in Tunlin that we have to get beforehand. And for this, I'm going to need Orcs. Um, Bo, you can go away for Ox. An Ox, you have to go in the lead. Um, I have to find the item shop here real quick, because I used some Marble 3s. I know, the item that I never use. Marble 3s! 
Please be one of these be a stash. Thank you. I'm gonna stash the flame shield and the mist sword. The rest of the stuff is super important. Um, please tell me you have marble threes. You have marb ones, not marb threes. I, was, I, I know some, I know a place I can get marb but threes easy, so I, I'll go there. <laughs> But it's just simply because I don't have Nina in my party. Why would I... You, why would I dare do anything with... You You know, dare to get lots of experience when I've got no Ninas. I'm down Ninas. I have none of the Ninas. Anyways, I should probably save. Yes. It has been good good luck. Anyways, um, yes, I am down the Ninas. And the reason why we have to come to Tunlin is because of... Nope. Oh. You take C nut. Anyways, now to teleport back to a place we haven't been in a long that's for you, not this. Uh let's reorganize this party real quick. Karn, since you're not fused, you are useless to me. Yes, this is my best party with car not fused. Anyways, time to warp back to Dorgan. Warping all the way back to Dorgan real quick. I know, it's crazy to think. Anyways. Also, it should be noted that I only look far enough ahead to get Nina out of amnesia. I do have no, I have no idea after that. Well, I know what happens after that. Like, what's the whole purpose of the Nina having amnesia and being sent back in time? I mean, that's kind of obvious if you've been paying attention to the whole story. She's going to become... Fly Girl. Anyways, I might as well rest up here since I'm back here. But first, the reason why I came here. To buy some Merbers. Yes. Oh, they do have Marb 3s. Good. I don't know how many I need. I'll just buy a few. I can buy two more. I should pro I should probably buy two more. Because you never know when I need the marb threes. Because even though I don't use marb the marb threes, marbs, marbles. Also, you know what I find hilarious is well, there's a particular, one of the particular Breath of Fire, other Breath of Fires. My favorite Breath of Fire, Breath of Fire 3, marbles have an entire, are entirely different. And they're useless. Utterly useless.
because it is just absolutely useless. It's a selling item in Breath of Fire 3. Marbles. I don't sell for much. Unless you wait for for the opportunity to get a antiquities shop opened up in the game. Yeah, that's the thing, antiquity shops. And actually, it's a good idea to get one of those in Breath of Fire 3 if you're playing it. I don't know why I'm giving tips for Breath of Fire 3. This is Breath of Fire 1. Focus, Dustin. Is that one of the first times I've ever said my name in a video? I don't remember. Anyways, um... I don't want to get into any fights. Oh, and I... Uh, putting Bo in the lead for temporary reasons. Going through the forests. Arb three. Yes, follow this path. So I don't know if I said this on camera, but I, like, with how, like, Alan and Searle's story ended, I knew there would have to be something more. But what more there is, is weird. And you're about to see it. Searle, wait! I'll marry Alan when I grow up! And that's how Searle and Alan's story ends. What in the world was that? I get they reverted back into kids, and that's all. That's that's, that's all right. I'm not complaining with that being the end of their story, really. But really. That's how they end Searle and Alan's story. Also, what do they do? Because no one knows their kids again. Like, as just... So bad. Anyways, follow the path. If you ever get lost, follow the dirt brick road. Follow the dirt brick road. Follow the dirt brick road. Do you get the idea? Follow the dirt brick road. Oh yeah, and that's something I... I was looking up famous people who died this year. Apparently the last munchkin from the Wizard of Oz died this year. I mean... How is... How? How have... How many of you people who are watching my video didn't even... Well, you know. You know what I'm trying to say. It was... Go down. And you see... A bridge! It's out! Also, you're supposed to talk to one of the people and they'll tell you how to get the poison fish. And you're probably wondering, why is he going into his items? I'm going to put an urchin on because why not?
Yeah, I, 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 yeah, I'm still confused about the whole Alan Searle thing. Anyways, but, uh... <laughs> Trust me, someone who writes a lot of stories about time travel, because if you don't know, I do... Well, if you've been a fan of my channel, and you know I write stories that, that deal with time travel is one of the main ideas. Anyways, but, uh... I, I think about time travel a lot. Yeah, Alan's not coming back. Well, not really. Anyways, but, uh, let's talk to the doctor. The good old doctor. Do you have all the ingredients? Wait here while I make the tonic. It's done. Ryu receives the tonic. The gel tonic. I'll wake any sleeping person and cure amnesia. That's just the power of the tonic. Get okay, his reference to game I've already played. Anyways, I think this is going to be a perfect example of a video that I cut down in length. Because people have been saying my videos are just a little too long. Well, usually I would consider them complaining whiners. Um, <clears throat> I mean, I can understand why people say it, but... I, and I really would prefer to make my video longer. But as I have... You know what I'm gonna do? I'm actually not gonna end it right away. I, because there, even though it's something not exactly a thing to do, we have a map. I'm pretty sure it's selected, it allows you to view map, right? Well, I have to check on the overworld. But anyways, because of something that's about to happen. Tunnel. Because the tonic is about to do something to our friend Nina. Automatic sequence activate! Nina takes the tonic. Why are you staring at me, Ryan? What's your problem? Nina has recovered from amnesia! Do you know who I am? Don't be silly, Karn. She's back! She's back! She's really, really back! She's back! She's back! Ooh, she's really, really back! What's the big fuss? I feel great! And I can fly! Nina joins the party, and she's got a new permanent sprite for the rest of the game. And although blue is my favorite color, I don't like the blue on her. She looked much better in pink. My personal pin I might have to change my mind after seeing her new in-menu sprite. Damn. Yeah, it's better. Yeah, okay, her new in menu portrait. Ooh, damn. Anyways, this means I can put Karn back in and refuse Karn. Not ref not refuse as in to turn away Karn. <laughs> Make Karn fuse him again. <laughs> I thought that was funny. Anyways, yeah. Damn. She looks awesome. Uh, okay, her overworld sprite looks 
way worse. But her new menu portrait? That is seriously gone. Damn. Damn, son. Hey, wait a minute. You're supposed to talk to those people. Um, you can talk to the people in this house and they'll say something now. You know, because you're taking the person they've been taking care of away. Take care. No, well, they just say take care. Anyways, but yeah, um... Yeah, Nina can fly now. I mean, if... I mean, the, the problem I have with that is they had to yada yada time travel into this story to make it so there was an excuse why Nina could fly. Let's rest up at the inn. Yeah, a little pricey, but... Yeah, why not? Hey, where are you? She's a bit older now. <laughs> Sorry, I, I... I'm dirty. I mean, the joke was there. And you gotta admit, 90% of you were thinking that after I was already being like, Damn, that, that portrait sprite is good looking. And it is, like, especially for this game's graphics. I think that portrait is really good. Am I weird for thinking that? Tell me in the comments. You think I'm a weirdo for liking Nina's new, new portrait. But yes, this is the equivalent of getting the airship. Also, now Gobi can do new shopping stuff. But I'd, I'll, I'll look at that later, but... You know, see if there's anything new that I must get. But look! Okay. Admit it, you knew this was going to be laggy because, well, it's flying. When is flying never not laggy? Oh, right, select. Wasn't it select? I'm going to use the map the old-fashioned way. Okay, I can't use the map the old-fashioned way. Okay, so it shows all the locations of all the towns. And major locations, I assume. So really, the only one to left to go to is Skond. We're really coming up at the end of this game now. Which is sad. But, let's go back to flying mode. Keep something and pressing R, not X. Wait a minute, it's not X. Why did I think the button you pressed to become bird was X? Okay, that, that town's still destroyed. Also, we never figure out, we never learned what that town's name was from Alan. Alan. Yeah, Scon Seas are red. We're gonna have to part the Red Sea? Okay, how. Uh, where is Scon? That does not look fun. I bet there's so many places we have to fly with Nina now, though. Like, 
Like, I know the game, like, is, like, just judging by the fact that Nina's a bird now. She can fly anywhere we want to. And his axes are airship. Which is weird, because this game already had a teleport spell and everything, and I don't know. Wait a minute, where am I? And I can't check the map while I'm in this. Why is it like that suddenly scanned as the only landmass? Okay, I'm just going insane. Never mind. Anyways, since I don't know, and I don't want to make a mistake because I know there's some side questing to be done! Because Ryu needs more dragon forms before the game is done. And also... There's some shopping to be done with Gobi! Well, that is, if there's anything to be got. Anyways, let's land. Damn. Damn. I don't even know what, ma what that makes that Nina look so good to me. I really don't. But yeah, um, besides, this is almost a 30 minute video with how much talking I've done. Anyways, but yes, I might, okay, the next video will probably be Christmas, on Christmas Day. And if you don't understand why, it's because, well, my first video that I ever uploaded on my channel was on Christmas Day two years ago. So, I always have to upload a video on Christmas from now on. That's the way it works, right? And also, but before that, and like, this is the main reason why, is because I need to clean up my house. Well, with my mom's help. Over when she, and she doesn't get much work in December. So, it's like, clean house. And then we've been invited to a friend's house for before Christmas or after Christmas. So either I'll be busy with going to that friend's house on Vancouver Island. It's a friend I've not seen, you know, since before I started my YouTube channel. And they are a dear, dear friend. And the, main, and the reason why we made this arrangement with, obviously, since I just told you I haven't made an arrangement with a friend, I made it with, with my, with my friend's parent, parents, well, parent mostly, not both their parents, was because of the fact that we recently had to go to my friend's great grandmother's funeral. It was very sad, but I didn't know her that well, so it was. No big deal. Anyways, this looks like a good place to sign off, and it's also time for me to stop talking. Except for the fact that I want to say, I will be seeing Clack and Voss at Christmas time. As we always do. Anyways, this looks like a good place to end off. So this is the Cowardly Time Lord signing off. And... What's this character how much signing off? And saying, have a good day, or whatever time it is, wherever you are. Bye bye now. Also, that's really laggy. Can you can tell that's lagging, right? Like, it literally snaps between open and closed hand. Okay, anyways. I already said bye-bye, so...